Yeah, yeah. Manchester City have been scoring lots of goals of late. What's been the secret behind that? Uh, I've, I think my point of view is, uh, is, is, uh, is, is, uh, is a new style we want to play football, you know, attractive, with more movement and uh, uh, have a lot of involved players in the, in, in the front and try to, 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 to score the goal. And I think now the, the team are set very well. You, we play very well and uh, I think the ambition of the manager is he wanted us to play a way like we play at home. And uh, we know it's not easier, but I think uh, now it's positive. Have those goals brought a newfound confidence to the team? Yeah, of course, of course, definitely, I think, because uh, the manager wants us to, 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 to score more goals and have uh, attractive football, I would say. But for, for us, the most important, we have, uh, we have to keep it going. We know it's very hard, especially in Premier League, uh, uh, to, 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 to predict this, this kind of things all every day, every two days as well. And, uh, is always difficult, but for, for us, the most important, we have to continue to keep going, working hard at training and try to, 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 to repeat in the game. Since you lost to Bayern Munich at home, you've then since won two games. Does that show that you've got that disappointment out of your system? Yeah, it was a, it was a, it was a, it was a big meeting against Bayern Munich and it was the game who everybody wants to play and who the club wants to see how how level we are from Bayern Munich because we, kn we knew he's, he's the champion in the Premier League and he's, he's a massive club. And uh, we're, we're quite disappointing for us and for the club, even for the fans, you know, because it was, was, was difficult when you see the game because I have to, I see the game a couple of times and I saw that it was quite hard. But I think the sport is in that, you know, in football especially, you can predict what can happen tomorrow, you know, and uh, next game, sorry. And, uh, I think it was, was good for me, it was good because uh, I always think when I lost or when I make something wrong and I learn from that, you know, and from, for next, when I come, I come more stronger. And I think we play against good team, very good team of Bayern Munich. They, was, they, was fun, they were fantastic this day. And for us, it was quite disappointing because we were playing at home and in front of our fans. But we want to, 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 we want to, to we, don't, we don't want to produce, to produce this more anymore, you know, and we want to be more stronger, play more better and uh, try to win. What did the boss say to you after that defeat to Bayern Munich? Oh, it was, uh, was disappointing for him. It was a shame, I think, for him as well, you know, because uh, we were playing, we, uh, we were in the big, uh, we were in a good side, you know, because we, we come from, from the derby against United and a couple of days ago we, we lost, I think, away. But, uh, at home, we have uh, good confidence, you know. But after the Bayern Munich loss, we come, we come, and we come back, and we try to to focus on the next game and try to be concentrated in every aspect possible. Tell us about your partnership that's developing with Fernandinho. How good is that, and how good is he to play with? Oh, Fernandinho is is very very clever footballer, you know. And the Brazilian player, you know how they are. They are very good, clever, and. Uh, and uh, he's always positive and uh, he, he, he can anticipate, you know, and uh, for me he's a fantastic player, you know, he's playing very well at the moment, he's helped the team and I uh, hope he will stay a lot of here in the city, yeah. With him in the team, do you expect to score more goals yourself? Oh, <laughs> it's difficult, well, it's a good question, but I think for me the most important, I always have to I, will, I, will, I always try to put the, 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 the strike in a good position, you know, try to give him the pass or try to help him score the goal. But for me, my, my mindset is just try to, to be this guy, this guy who is in between both lines, you know, try to help the defence, even the striker as well. I know it's, sometimes it depends a lot of uh, power from me, but it's, some, it's why I love, you know, I love running, I love help my teammate. And, uh, uh, for me, the most important is always try to, to give fast first, and if you have an opportunity to score, I, I, will, I will be delighted. What can you tell me about CSKA Moscow, your opponents? Oh, very good team, very good team. I think at uh, that moment, in the, in, the champ in the Premier and their league, they are not in the top, but they have a good, they have a good team, they have good players, so they are very good. And uh, they have a couple of friends I, I knew already, uh, Dumbia Sedu is a very good player. Musa has played with Nigeria as well, it's very, very fast. And they have uh, Kagawa, they have a couple of Russian players as well. At front, they are, they are very good. And we have to be careful because uh, 
they, they, they want uh, pills as well and uh, they want to get the three point to, and they have failed and uh, we want as well to get the three point. We knew it's going to be difficult, but for the, the most important, we have uh, in our mind the focus of, uh, of for this year is to try to, to go to the second round and uh, I hope we will do that. There's been a lot about talk about the pitch you're going to play on. Is that going to play a big part in the game? Uh, some moment, yeah, can play big part, but I think uh, I think uh, it's going to be difficult for them as well. But you know, with the attractive football we want to play and uh, uh, a magnificent football we want to play is always difficult, you know, and a difficult beach. But for me, it's, it's not a big difference, you know, because I already play with today this kind of beach because I will when we when I went to to an Africa combination, they they feel that sometimes they say maybe worse, but. Uh, for the player we go, honestly, we, it's going to be difficult, you know, because with uh, the player like Silva, Aguero, who is a fantastic player, I think the, the, the pitch can affect us, yeah, I can say yes. This is Manchester City's third pr Champions League campaign. What have you learnt from those previous years when you failed to get out of the groups, yeah, yeah? Uh, learn, I think I learned, like... Uh, if you want to, if you want to go through, we all have, we always have to come away and get the result. You know, try to win or get a draw and be strong at home. You know, because uh, with my experience being in the in the top world, the top world club and world, you know, like Barcelona, it was always that you know, achieve something away and try to win at home as possible. And uh, that's that's why that's all about the Premier, the Champions League. You know, uh, is two game win away and win or draw and win at home. That's very important for to, 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 to your continuity and the continuity of the team. Yeah. Do you think some of the problems in the, in the past have been down just to performance or about the mental attitude you need to adopt to this competition? I think, uh, I think the mental attitude, yeah. You know, try to be concentrated in all aspects, you know, because uh, in, the, in the Champions League, uh, they are, we, we, you meet all big team, you meet good team, you meet clever team, you know, and uh, it's just few things that make difference, you know, in set PC or a movement or concentration. If you lose two minutes or one minute of your concentration, you can be you can be cash in the back. And uh, I think uh, we, we we learned that, and the manager is helping the team as well. But I think everything is, is nice at the moment, yeah. And talking about mental attitude, has your goalkeeper Joe Hart demonstrated in recent matches how tough he is to come back from the criticism he's? Yeah, I know it's always difficult, you know, to be criticized and uh, receive some criticism like that, you know, because Joe Hart, first of all, is is young and uh, is uh, is uh, is achieving something. And uh, for me, is impressive, you know. He's always calm, even with uh, this hard criticism for him, you know. After the game, I think he, he, like a player, we knew like uh, we know like uh, he's not only one player. We lost together and we win together, you know. Was. The, the, the four will start from somewhere else, you know, and uh, all the time, uh, all the time when you receive the crystal like that, like that you're always positive and try to, 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 to respond in the next game or on the, uh, the next uh, champion is coming. And uh, that's why I, I have a lot of respect for him and uh, Joel is fantastic.